This is our project title, CLACCF, a clustering based collaborative filtering approach for big data application. This is an abstract of our project. In the recent days, the web domain is augmented with new types of services with the increase in surveys and cloud computing. As a result, new forms of web content collecting and designing is done based on the numerous openly available web services on them. These services are utilized in many ways by different domains and with exponential growth of these web services. Users are experiencing the difficulties in finding and utilizing the best matching service called the mashup service. A collaborative filtering approach is going to filter and recognize the similar services under same cluster and followed by those evaluation recommendations are made. Especially in our process, we are going to use an agglomerated clustering algorithm to perform clustering process and for the similarity evaluation, we are going to use three types of similarities. One is a Jacquard similarity, then Cosset similarity, then the characteristic similarity which is a combination of Jacquard and Cosset similarity. Finally, we provide our output result as in the form of the recommendation list. This is the flow diagram of our process. That is the DSP of our process. In this, we just first enter into the system. Afterwards, we receive the input. The input is in the form of the textile recommendation. So, here we provide the information as the dress information as the input. After the input, we have performed the pre processing step. In the pre processing, we are going to remove the unwanted values. After that, we are going to perform the stemming process. In the stemming process, we are going to convert the keywords, that is in the normal words into keyword. The keyword conversion takes place in the stemming process. After that, the similarity evaluation takes place. There are three types of similarity. In the Jacquard similarity, it contains both the Jacquard similarity and the Cousin similarity. Afterwards, we perform the characteristic similarity. Finally, we perform the clustering process. In the clustering process, we provide the agglomerative clustering algorithm. After that, for the similarity and correlation analysis, the, here we are going to perform the pairs and correlation coefficient. Then we finally use the predictor rating. Then the process gets in. Finally, the rating get predicted. In addition to the predictor rating, we are also provide the recommendation list as the output. Our output is a recommendation. The recommendation list is mainly for provide the alternate solution for our process. Because if the user preferable item is not present, means he cannot get satisfied. So, for that, we provide the alternate solution for our process. Let us see the demo of our system. First of all, we will find the VM workstation and provide the Hadoop username as a Hadoop hyphen user. Provide the password as the Hadoop. And then we open the Eclipse software. In the Eclipse software, the project name is Club CF. In that, right click the homepage.java. Then run this. Run on Hadoop. In this, choose an existing server. Then click finish. This is the home page of our process. Here we are going to load our data set. Click the browse and select the article record. Then open. This is the file name, file size and the file type. Then. Here we are going to view the information present in our data set. Then we load the information into the database. Then we perform the pre-processing step. In the pre-process, the unwanted values are get removed, like null values, question mark, etc. Then the pre-process results get stored in the HDFS Hadoop distributed file system. Then view that information. Next, then we perform the stemming process. The stemmed results also get stored in the HDFS. Then click these are the stemmed results. 
then we are going to perform the first similarity that is a description similarity here we are going to use the check out similarity measure similar the similarity gets calculated after that use the similarity itself here we are going to perform the similarity for the each and every child present in our data set then next then we are going to perform the functional similarity in the functional similarity process here we are going to use the cosine similarity approach similarity calculated successfully then use the functional similarity values then next here we are going to perform the characteristic similarity in the characteristic similarity it is a combination of functional similarity and the jacot similarity then use the characteristic similarity lesson next then we are going to perform the clustering process in the clustering process we are going to use a agglomerative hierarchical clustering it is one of the hierarchical clustering and it follows the bottom up approach the clustering process takes place then use the clustered result these are the clustered result in the cluster the, the uh, cluster 3 these are all the informations are present cluster 2 these are all the informations here the clustering is divided into three types of clusters some of those styles are present in each cluster then next this is the user preference page this is the main user page here the user should select their preference that is a nothing but a set here i select the casual as a preferable set then we evaluate the relevant cluster in this cluster only our preferable style is present these are all the res information related to our style then we evaluate the rating that is the similarity of our preference to the existing user preference then click ok then view that preferable values this is a casual preference preference similarity values this is one and then we provide rating prediction we are going to predict the rating of the user preference that is based on the user preference we are going to predict the rating our predictor rating is a 5 for the preference casual then here this is a final page in this page we provide the recommendation style as the output just click our recommendation style that is our recommendation list is a our preferable style is a casual we can able to purchase the party style as a optional one here this is for the feedback page here we are going to enter the user id then here we can able to choose any of your feedbacks if it is excellent you, this recommendation is satisfied for you means you just click excellent then record the feedback record is successful then view then view the feedback results these are all the existing user feedback then show the comparison evaluation here we have performed the two types of comparison one is execution time another one is a efficiency this is a execution time here we are going to compare the hybrid collaborative filtering approach, clustering based approach, content based approach. The clustering based approach takes less execution time compared to the other approaches. Then the efficiency. Efficiency is higher for our clustering based approach apart from the hybrid based approach and the content based approach. The comparison evaluation, here we are going to compare the hybrid collaborative filtering approach testing based approach and content based approach in hybrid collaborative approach it is a combination of model based approach these are also existing approaches in the content based approach it only based on the contents if it is a textile recommendation means it only based on the textile information follow it provide the recommendation so in the efficiency process it provide the over, it test overall the contents afterwards only based on user preference it performs the results in the hybrid approach it based on the model that is a design that is a design and uh, some somewhat etc so based on that only it provide the recommendation but in the clustering based approach initially we provide the that is the analyzing of data takes place first of all we collect the information analyze the styles present in the information then we perform the clustering process and store the results after when the user enter their preference based on the preference we provide the exact result to the users if in case the exact result that is user preferable style is not available means it provides the optional that is an alternate solution which is a recommendation recommendation list this is an alternate solution for you can able to purchase that item also so 
both the efficiency evaluation and the execution time evaluation because of this clustering approach we can able to search the particular result only in the exact cluster alone you need not able to search the information in the all clusters so it reduces the time it reducing the searching time response time etc it provide the recommendation less in a very short execution time thank you